ladies and gentlemen, we are headed back to the danger zone with another cocktail recreation from Archer. Now we've already done the peppermint patty and the hotly requested follow-up was this green Russian. Come on in. What? Just making a fresh batch of green Russians. And I can already tell you right now, this is gonna be terrible. And Dollar Shave Club has made the unfortunate mistake of sponsoring this terrible video, but more to come on that later. Now we actually do have the recipe for this drink from the show thanks to the animator who worked on it. And that's gonna start with one ounce or 30 mils of absinthe into a rocks glass over ice. Next we need another ounce or 30 mils of our vodka. And yes, I know this should be a Russian vodka. And then finally, we're just gonna top that with two ounces or 60 mils of heavy cream. I'm already regretting this. Give that a good old stir and just hope that that cream will mask the taste of what we've concocted here. But uh, who am I kidding? There is no way this is going to be good. Let's just get it over with. And yeah, this is absolutely disgusting. I had to spit it right out. There's just too much absinthe in here and the cream doesn't have really much sugar to do any kind of balance. It is terrible. Do not make the green Russian. However, I think we can make a version of this that actually tastes good while retaining the spirit of the green Russian, pardon the pun. Let's see if we can have some fun with this green chartreuse and green tea. For our dairy, we're gonna add one cup or about 235 mils of whole milk to a bowl because we're gonna be making a clarified milk punch. Buckle up. Put that aside and then grab a pitcher to which we're gonna add two cups or about 470 mils of brewed green tea. Then we're gonna add one third cup or about 75 mils of fresh lime juice. Another one third cup or 85 grams of sugar. Two thirds cup or 150 mils of green chartreuse. And finally, another two thirds cup or 150 mils of vodka. Give that a quick stir to dissolve the sugar and I'm feeling like we should pour this into the milk. Pam, what do you think? <laughs> Absolutely not. Now, too late, it is happening. And right away, you will see that the acidity from the lime juice is causing the milk to curdle. Now, what's happening here is that the casein proteins of the milk are coagulating and they'll actually bind to some of the astringent tasting tannins of the tea. Now, I know you're thinking this looks pretty gross. Don't worry, we're gonna filter all this stuff out and you'll see why that makes this drink awesome. Now this filtering is a multi-step process. So I'm gonna start by putting a strainer over a Cambro and then filter all of it through this nut milk bag. That's gonna capture a lot of the big curdles first. Now if you're a no waste person, you can save those curds and maybe make a cheese or maybe some hipster face lotion, I don't know. But then we're gonna collect all that into a pitcher and we can see it's not very clear yet. So we need to do another pass through a fine coffee filter. Now I will warn you, this process takes a long time. To get it through that fine coffee filter is gonna take upwards of 30 minutes. But just set it and forget it. Once it goes all the way through, I usually run it through again one more time and it's much quicker the second time. And what we're left with is this incredibly clear punch and because the whey protein from the milk remains, this is gonna have a lot of body and richness. And if you keep this cool, it will last for years without spoiling. So this is gonna yield about five five ounce servings and we're gonna just take a rocks glass with a clear ice cube and pour it over the top. Now that is a thing of beauty right here. All right, so we got all the elements of the green Russian. We got our green, we got our vodka, we got our milk. Let's give it a taste. Man, whenever I have a clarified milk punch, I'm always blown away by just how smooth and rich it is. The astringency from the green tea is completely gone and you just get this delicious herbal sweet punch that goes down real easy. Phrasing. Again, a huge thank you to Dollar Shave Club for sponsoring this video. I am a huge fan of these guys' products. They are super high quality, they smell awesome, and they go actually beyond shaving products now. It's got things like shower, oral care, deodorants, and even uh, butt wipes. And actually right now they have this great offer where you can get their whole shave, shower, or oral starter set for only five bucks. Now here's what you get in each set. First is the shave starter set, which has their executive razor and three one ounce tubes of their Dr. Carver shave products, which includes prep scrub, shave butter, and post shave dew. Then they got this oral care starter set, which has this toothbrush that has a really nice weight to it, and you get a trial size version of their toothpaste. 
And finally, they have their shower starter set, which has three trial-sized versions of their amber lavender body cleanser, citrus and Hawaiian ginger face cleanser, which, by the way, smells unbelievable, and their sage and black pepper shampoo. And these guys are great. They'll ship all the products right to your house. And right now, if you go to dollarshaveclub.com slash cocktails, you'll get your first starter set for just five bucks. If you guys do make a purchase of Dollar Shave Club through my link, it really goes a long way to support the channel. And as always, all my recipes and equipment can be found on my website. Hope you all enjoyed this, and until next time, cheers.